Generic greetings, fellow citizens of the internet. This is, of course, Richard, and today I bring you another episode of FOV. So, leaving off, picking up basically where I left off, and write whatever I'm trying to say there. Um, added some plants of sugarcane there. Uh, farm is growing nicely. And I did do a little bit more with this down here. And I'm actually thinking I'll do a bit of caving to start this off because I did find a ravine that is rather impressive uh, beyond that everything's more or less where we left it so forth so on gonna go along the edge here first try and get some stuff a little bit lit up so I don't have monsters dropping down on me when I go down below Hopefully everything will be visible when I'm caving. I know that that's a problem for many other folks, YouTubers, who do this kind of thing. But, um, hopefully I will be able to maintain visibility with torches and so forth. Uh, it must be lava down there. This looks like a promising cave system sort of dealio. I've been intending to get more into caving and so forth in this series because I am an absurdly cautious player in general and as a result I often even just avoid caving entirely which you know is a bad habit and it's good to know you know how to cave in the game of Minecraft where caving is something of a necessity so I will be making an effort to at least do occasional mining runs and so forth through caving and so forth and so on dark lava huzzah it's always very interesting when things like that happen Let's see if we can get the light to update from over here yeah there we go boom uh, let's see if I can get this. Yes! Hooray! Okay, and... Wow, yeah, I don't know how much you can see that, but... Some cool stuff going on. After this video, I'll have a slightly better idea of what one can and cannot see on the YouTubes. Okay, fine, I'll start using cobblestone. Whatever. So, let's see. Once I get some basic resources and so forth, once I get tired of doing this, which, I have no idea, whatever, I'll just sort of do this for a while, do some caving, hopefully not die. Dying would be very unfortunate indeed. Uh, once I've done a bit of this, I will probably swap over and smelt some of the uh, iron that I have and make myself some shears because I need to get some shears and bed sort of stuff going on otherwise things are gonna get a little bit ridiculous and I was I mean looking at that village the other day they rather clearly need some assistance with architecture and fortification given that too many monsters come through they're gonna be done for if they don't get a wall up and they don't have any real proper walls around the city so I'll need to, thinking I'm going to help him out and throw a wall around some kind. What's over here? Oh, it sort of continues. That's interesting. Very interesting. Uh, oh, this is, no. Eh, that was, that was a bad move. Bad, very bad move on my part. Should not have done that. Let's see. Grab this iron over here. And maybe I'll try and get down to, if I can clear the top of this ravine over here, maybe I'll even go down to the bottom and see if I can find some uh, diamonds or something. Don't know how deep this goes exactly, but might be deep enough. Get some cool stuff going. But... At any rate, at any rate, uh, let's see this. Just 
build right across here quick and simple see what's going on over here oh wow okay very interesting indeed very very interesting build down get down there a bit check this out being careful to leave a pathway so that I can get back up again and also keeping half an eye on my hunger because I don't want to put myself in any situations lava is good providing some amount of light on the subject grab myself a mushroom mushrooms are always good um, then let me do that so that I can more easily get back up again. Go ahead and do that so that there isn't water all over the place. Quite so much. And uh, maybe I'll go ahead and explore over here a bit. Is there really... There isn't... Uh, that wasn't deliberate. Didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that. It's okay. Uh, slam some torches down around. Maybe... Explore along edge here a bit. Again, I'm paranoid about monsters dropping down on me. That's potentially rather interesting. A little offshoot cave. Which goes nowhere. Boop doop boop boop doop boo. Coal is good. Coal allows me to do coal type things. Smelting and torches and so on. Rather obviously, good resource to have around, so I will collect anything that I see, more or less, at least at this stage of the game. Uh, and it does give XP, so it's nice to have, nice to, nice to get. Makes me happy. Makes me happy. Good amount here, that's good. What you kind of expect from coal. And my pick's gone. You know what? Tell it. I'm going back up to the surface. Sort of flip-flopping my way back and forth. Another cave down there. So forth and so on. Scoping things out a little bit. Sure, why not? That's cool. And yes, I will head back now. Don't really have the supplies for a proper caving run at the moment. And be much better idea to get better equipped before I do any mass mining uh, in the caving domain. Where the heck was the path back up? It was over here, wasn't it? Yes, right here. Brilliant. Get back up here, and hopefully grab myself some food. Hopefully some of that weed is ready. At least as a backup. Oh, and it's nighttime. Awesome. Sugar cane is good. Okay, I'm going to throw down some cobble here. I don't like doing that kind of thing, but there we go. At least it'll be navigable. Nav navigatable. Not nav whatever. And replant the wheat right like that. And hmm. I really want to check that out just as soon as day comes. What time of day is it? Do I have any kind of view to a Oh, it's just starting to be nighttime. Drat. Drat. Alright, change of plans in that case. I guess I will just re-equip a bit. Perhaps drop off some unnecessary stuff and do a bit more caving. That is just fine. I can do that. I've got quite a bit more to explore. Uh, perhaps I can get this smelting and get myself an iron pick. As well as probably a bucket phone going off. I will ignore it. It'll be fine. Then, um, after that, I'll probably want to drop off uh, some of these additional nonsense resources I've got kicking around that I will not need down in the caves. Remember to plant these birch and so forth saplings around. That'll look good. I think if I just plant a few around here, that'll look nice. Around in the hills, make this place a bit more birchy. Always like birchness. 
uh, let's see, if I make a pick and a bucket and yeah, that's six, then I'd have two left for the shears. Good. That would that's what I'm gonna do. Pick plus bucket plus shears. That will be ideal. For now I just need the bucket what why what? No, that's not no. There we go. Okay. There and there. Make myself a few more torches. Why did I make so many sticks? I only just realized how many sticks I made there and it was a rather unreasonable and unnecessary number. Alright, and so one, two, three picks for now, maybe. boop a doo bit a bit a doo And a sword. It's gonna be more or less crucial. I am actually gonna need more sticks though. It's fine. Um so then shovel. I'm also gonna want an axe later, less than now, more just the shovel for now, but we'll want it eventually. I'll actually just throw it in the chest for now. And the sand can go in there too. And the hoe. Then grab these, make them into shears, and stick those in the chest. Boop. The dupe. That's not shears. No, 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 no. Cooperate. Come on. Cooperate with me. Work with me, game. Alright. And now I should be more or less prepared. Uh, sort of. Throw that in my hotbar. Got a decent number of torches. Whatever. Alright. We'll go for it. And... I'll just go ahead and head down, hit up the bottom of the ravine, and check it out, see what happens, see what's down there. Is there anything over here worth noting beyond giant deadly lava craziness? There is this iron, which I may as well grab while I'm here. I just heard a skeleton. Gotta sneeze. It's okay, I'll just look at the lava. You're supposed to look at light when you need to sneeze, right? Good times. Uh, so that's basically the end of the ravine, I guess. And... Yeah. Down a torch there. Grab another mushroom. Actually need to get over there. Dangerous. Very dangerous incredibly dangerous regardless okay let's do this I'll just head down to the bottom now I guess it's a bad idea hello zombie he is a villager zombie hopefully that is not a sign of foul dirty deeds done at the local village where did he go he was here one second ago. Where'd he go? Oh, he's over there. Okay. Hello there. Ow. Yep, that was clumsy. Oh. More zombie. I'm gonna die to zombies if I'm not careful. Would be clumsy. I am not regening, of course, because I do not have food of any kind. So I think I'm gonna actually make a. <laughs> I might need to make a premature tactical tactical retreat. Uh, grab this water though before I go. Boop doo 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 doo. That's what. That's lava down there. Whoa! Whoa! What? What's going on? I'm hearing sounds. Sounds are not good when I'm on two hunger and three and a half hearts. I'm gonna go ahead. Tactical retreat. That seems secure. That seems sort of secure. I'll grab this iron on my way. I can get away with that. Because more iron is better. 
Perhaps I can get myself some armor, and then I won't be quite as paranoid. I will be, but I... I don't know. Whatever. A lot of jumping to get back to the surface, though, and I'm a little bit worried about that, because I've only got one hunger left. I should have thought this through a bit better. Going the right direction would help as well. But... Eh. Yeah, this is, this is really bad. Oh, didn't I learn my lesson before? Alright, well, if I start starving, I will... Bite the bullet and bite the zombie flesh. Uh, let's see, where is the. There it is. Yep, here it is. Here we go. Uh, so hungry. Alright, so back up to the surface. And I'll. Time of the day. Oh, it is actually daytime. So that that's good. That is very good. Uh, only one more wheat. That's not what I was hoping for. Oh well. Replant. Then drop this off. Actually, I can just grab a bunch of stuff. Probably gonna be heading right out again. Drop those. Pick up the shears. Drop off a pick or two. Don't need all those. Probably drop off some... Get out of my hand. There we go. Drop off some of this cobble. Um, I can get some more iron smelting. Then I think I'm going to set right on out and get right out of here. Do some exploration. Before anything else, I'm going to check out that dungeon, though. I'm very, very curious. want to know what's going on with that. Uh, that, whatever. No creepers? Nothing? Good. Very good. Very good. Alright, now I'm just gonna storm right on in here, whack down as many torches as possible. Too late, there's already a skeleton. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Retreat. Ah! Second death. Second episode. At least things are working out nicely. Where that is concerned, where am I relative to everything? that way. Wait, what? Oh, fall damage. Okay. Whew. Okay. Heading off. The general area. I died, I believe. I think it was off here. I, I mean, I think that's where things are. I thought it was that way more, but there's an ocean that way, so I'm pretty sure I actually went further this way and then... Yeah, right here. Okay. Okay, this is it. Good, good. Now I have a better idea of where things are in relation to one another. That's good. Alright, so now I have at least full health, full hunger again. Uh, where are my torches? Grab torches first. Okay, sword and... <laughs> I get the getting wood achievement. No! 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 No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, no. <laughs> as many torches as possible. Come around the corner, come around the corner, I freaking dare you. Mmm, mmm, no! Oh, I don't like these skeletons. Skeletons are very angry now. They're, they're, they are absolutely evil. Oh, jeez, he's in my face. Okay, 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 don't panic. Don't panic. Where is he? He's coming around the corner. No, he's not. Where is he? Come on. Come at me! No! Don't just stand there! Oh, I... Mm, they're too smart. They're far too smart. My saplings are over there. Okay, 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 we got this. Yes, 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 yes. There we go. Now it's all set. Now it's all set. It is a skeleton dungeon, which, for the purposes of conquering it initially, was kind of a pain in the neck. But now that it is conquered, it is absolutely glorious, because that will make a wonderful farm. Three music discs, a saddle. Oh, this is glorious. Name tag and a saddle right ready for me to find my horse and name it, give it a saddle. I'm happy. I am very happy. Let's make torch placement make a little more sense here. Alright, uh, that looks a little bit dark. Gonna go ahead and be a little bit paranoid about dark spaces near the spawner because of course they can spawn anywhere near spawner, so forth, so on. 
the sa saplings. Good, yes, saplings. Hooray! Okay. Arrows sticking out of me from all directions. Three hearts. Whatever. Hopefully I'll find some food. Drop down the saplings. That's excellent. Very good. Very good. I'll drop down these other saplings closer to the village so that I can make a use of those over there. My, and I am keeping my eyes peeled. What time of day? Noon! Good. Very good. Alright. I'm keeping my eyes Hi. I am keeping my eyes peeled as I fall into a lake. Alright. I am keeping my eyes peeled for any sheep. This thing over here is still absolutely amazing. I, I cannot believe. I just cannot believe at all. Uh, let's see. Drop a sapling there. Drop a sapling here. That's cave. Drop a sapling here. Drop another sapling. Another sapling. Drop it. Drop it. Do boop -ba doo. Let's see. Where's the village? The village is right over here. Were there any sheep? Is the other good question. Uh, there are friggin' horses everywhere. But that is not what I'm looking for at the moment. That's right. The, there were the trees over there. Wow. Forgot about that. But if I can find myself some horses, that would be great. Why have I been messing about with all of these food problems when I have all those farms right there? I didn't... It did not even cross my mind. And that that is bad. That's not a good thing. Wow. All right, well, well now that I've realized that, I'm more or less set for food. I just need to be sure to keep this place secure at night. So until I've got the wall, I'm gonna need to sleep or get out of here. Oh, carrots! Yes, carrots are very good. And did I get potatoes anywhere? That would be the crowning wonder of marvelousness. So if I got potatoes spawned in one of these things. Eat, don't kill the garden. Harvest some more carrots. Lots of carrots. Carrots are good. Hello, sir. Oh, chicken. I don't have that much, sorry. <laughs> ah, yes, potatoes! Delightful! Glorious. Obviously, they are not much use to me at this precise moment, given that I don't have any means to cook them. But, nevertheless... Nevertheless. Ah, and more down here. Good. Very, very good. So now, next step, sheep. Wait! No! I... I can explore this. Let's see. I can actually take the wood, the wool right from here. And... Carve my way down this temple. This will be very interesting indeed. Better disarm it as soon as possible. <laughs> Alright. Let's see. What have I got going on down here? I've got a full inventory going on. That's what I've got. All right, mundane, mundane, that's fine, that's fine. It's all right, mundane is okay. Bones are actually going to be quite helpful, while I think about it, potentially. The growing of food, iron is good. Yeah, not much, not a whole lot. Gold, gold is good. Uh, I guess I'll drop the wheat here for now. That's more or less everything of extreme value. Sorry, if everybody on the YouTubes could not see there. That was clumsiness, whatever. Uh, then I guess I'm just gonna... No, don't do... Oh! Okay, today I learned breaking TNT doesn't actually cause... Doesn't actually damage your pick. Good to know! Very good to know. Cool. Drop off that stuff. 
there. And... Uh, am I gonna get out of here? Let's go this way. Boop do. Throw another torch so that stuff doesn't spawn down here. At some point I'll probably come back and fix all that and make it look nicer. Oh, hi! Hello there. Hanging out in the temple. Alright. Light this place up just a bit. Be on the safe side. And now, after I harvest some more potatoes, potatoes are good, I can actually, and as a matter of fact, process down some wood, mill it down, whatever, make a bed. Ray for the bed, we'll set up in the library so as not to intrude upon any villagers. Only sleep at night, I knew that. Actually, I'm gonna set this up right over here. Um, come on, come on. I don't want monsters spawning. No, this is making me uncomfortable. Okay, there we go. Very good, very good, very good indeed. This is very good. I am very happy right now. Very happy indeed. Okay. Wanna do that. Wanna make myself chest for some of the awesomeness that I have gathered. My records, my valuable name tag and saddle which I will probably use on a horse just as soon as I've learned a little bit more about how the hell horses work. Or at least looked around and checked out what sorts of horses there are to be found. Some gold is good. TNT is very good. And... What else can I drop off? The other thing is I shall eat, regenerate some of my hunger, regenerate some of my hearts, because I eat a carrot. Now my leg is back. That is how video games work. That is how things work all the time and clearly it's the only true way to look at reality. Okay, so this is looking dangerous down here. We're gonna wanna... First I'll probably plot out how I wanna throw the wall through and how I want to wall this off because in order to keep things from getting too hairy around here I'm definitely gonna need to put up a wall let's see I want to put down some trees that'll look good and it'll be good and functional as well be nice to have trees around for harvesting purposes Grab some more carrots. Ba -doo -boo -ba -doo. And interesting. Very interesting. Trying to figure out how I'm gonna set up roads through here. Gonna need to excavate away some of this sand. I can only imagine the sandstorms that have blown around and covered this place in the sands of time or whatever and let's see how am I gonna wanna do this I'm probably gonna wanna put what, what do I wanna what do I wanna use what do I wanna use how do I wanna do this boop doop doop do uh what resources can I spare well if I make myself a furnace I can process myself down some stone. Don't do that. Alright, furnace. I didn't see if this town had a blacksmith. I don't think it did. Uh, then, maybe 32 right there. And then, 4, no, 4, there we go. 
and get that going. That will give me some material to work with. I'm trying to think if I might be able to use birch wood for a bit of it. I uh, want to use some smooth sandstone, almost certainly. I'm going to want to excavate a portion of the desert or something. Possibly over there, I'll just start up a sand quarry. I'll probably do that off camera. Uh, I don't think I'm actually going to get to building the wall today. I think that's safe to say. But over here looks like a good spot for a bridge. It might be good to have a bridge that comes right across over to there and connects up to whatever I build over there eventually. And then do things like that. And yeah, it should work out pretty well. Did this have a blacksmith? I don't see a blacksmith. So I think it's safe to say it doesn't have a blacksmith. Oh, look at this. That's... <laughs> that sucks. Dude. There you go. There you go. It's a nice house. Nice house, dude! Very nice house. I like it. No. This place would definitely get ugly at night. I'm gonna have to find creative ways to light up the whole place. But... These guys deserve a hand. There we go. You can be out of your house now. That's fine. Here. You can too. Yeah! Hi. Alright, so... Wandering aimlessly around. Not accomplishing a whole heck of a lot. You know what? I think I might just... Break it off around here and then get to doing some stuff off camera because I can build the walls perhaps build up the walls a bit and get some other stuff done uh, so forth and so on and yeah I am in a significantly better space than I was last time I ended a recording I now have some more goodies to work with, and I am not constantly worried about starving to death. Which, obviously, I could have sort of... It didn't need to be an issue in the first place, but whatever, whatever. That's as may be, and for now, I suppose, I will say that with that, I'll conclude this episode and respectfully bid you farewell for now.